On the ice now here in the Alamo Dome is Teresa Aiello out of Stamford, Connecticut, trying to crack the top three if she can, the top three of Pittman Street and Thomas. She has already had a couple of falls. Triple Salkoff, some really hard falls. And it's really difficult to say what is causing these falls. It could be the fact that the skater may not be in the condition to get through the program without any problem, and it could be a technical problem. Let's see if she can... Cheeky kind of labeled it to being exhausted, tired. Yes, and now she did a nice triple toe loop there. And remember, this is a free program there are a lot of jumps to complete remember also many of these youngsters you're watching are moving up from the junior class of competition now, the experience factor is not yet there however they're gaining it right now oh sure and a double flip jump A little hesitant on this double axle. She landed it, but just held back a little bit on the takeoff. Seniors all hometown Stamford, Connecticut. And the huge crowd gives Teresa Aiello their applause. Third in the juniors this year, and third in the Eastern juniors this year. And to repeat what you have said, Peter, with Michelle Kwan still to come, and she is up next. We have seen an awful lot of falls today. Well, I said earlier that it's hard to point out what the problem is, but let's take a look at this jump. She's straight in the air, just doesn't get the left leg out and behind her. At the end of that jump, you've got to really push that landing leg out. Now, here's the triple toe loop. Again, straight in the air, that leg came around, and she finished the jump that time. The leg that is stretched out and back is very important for the success of the landing. Waiting now for her marks. And as she waits for her marks, the crowd here waits for the last skater of the day, the one we've been talking about for some time, Michelle Kwan, who is on the ice warming up, and she will be next. Now, for Teresa Aiello, her technical marks. And the, these will affect what happens with the placement for sure. Three have judged her in the fives, the other below that. Now she was fourth coming into the free program. These next marks will tell us where she will she end up. She could move into third. Yes. Could move into third. Let's see what happens. I don't think so, though. Now in the fours again. She has moved into second place as of the moment with Michelle Kwan next on the ice. 